So we're ready to begin segment three, yoga with weights from a prone position. For the first exercise, we recline back on our back. And then we're going to circle our arms up, catch a dumbbell in each hand and make sure your elbows remain nice and bent. So for this exercise, we need to raise both the legs up 90 degrees. And if you have a weak back, then be careful and raise up just one leg at a time like this. And if you don't have any back problems, then both the legs can come up together. So now we begin. On the exhale, we raise up both the legs up and you can keep your knees a little bent and at the same time, circle the arms down to the floor. Inhale as we hold and with the next exhale, we lower the legs and we circle the arms back overhead, keeping the elbows nice and bent and that's one. So 10 of these, exhale as we lift the legs and circle the dumbbells to the floor. Inhale holding and exhale again, legs go down and the arms go overhead and that's two. Exhaling, legs come up, simultaneously the arms should go down. Inhale holding and exhaling, back again, legs come down and arms go overhead and that's three. Exhale, into position, 90 degree legs. Inhale, as we lower down with control, trying to keep that lower back nice and pressed into the floor. Four. On the exhale, lift the legs and circle the arms down. Inhale holding and exhaling again, we lower the legs and lower the arms down and that's five. Press the lower back as you exhale, the legs up and circle the arms down and exhale again as you lower the legs and get the hands, arms to the floor and that's six. Exhale as we lift and then inhaling we pause, exhaling again lower the legs and then on the inhale we pause here seven. Exhale, lift and smoothly with control, inhale holding and exhale once again lower the legs and arms go back eight. So last two, exhale, into position, inhale, we hold, exhale, legs down, arms up, nine, inhale, hold, and one last, exhaling, into position, and with the next exhale, lower the legs down, and that's ten. So for the next exercise, we need our legs to be in a V position, and the arms out by our side, shift can scoot down a bit and arms extended in line with the shoulders, excellent. We're going to turn that right arm down and keep the left arm the way it is with the palm facing up. So on an exhaling breath, we're going to get the left dumbbell and the right foot to touch. And let's begin, exhale, touch, inhale, keep the elbow nice and bent, one. So eight of these, exhale, as we lift and touch, inhale, elbow nice and bent, two. Exhale, the elbow bent throughout, don't strain that elbow, and that's three. Exhale, lift and touch, inhaling, four. Keep the arm muscles relaxed as well, exhale. On the inhale, we come back, five. Exhaling, lift and touch, inhale back, six. Exhale, inhale, seven. Exhale, keep the lower back pressing into the floor, and that's eight. Now eight more, the same way, except this time, we lift the torso up every time. So you're going to use that right arm to help you. You're going to press it down into the floor. Press the right elbow down to help propel you up. And let's begin. Exhale. Lift and touch. Inhale, lower down one. Exhale. As we come up, inhale down two. Exhale. Lift and touch. Inhale three. Exhale. As we lift, inhaling four. Exhale. Keep pressing the right arm into the floor. And five. Exhale as we lift, great for the abs as well, six, exhale, and lower down, seven, and then one last, and that's eight. Now turning the arm position, left arm goes down, and we turn the right arm up without lifting the body eight times, and let's begin, exhale, this time, right arm, left leg, and back, one, exhale, remember to keep the right elbow bent throughout, and then two. Right elbow bent as you lift and lower, inhaling back, three, exhale, as we lift, inhaling, four, exhale, touch, inhaling, five, on the exhale we lift, inhaling, six, exhale, inhale back, seven, and then one last exhaling, inhaling, eight, now eight more lifting the torso up. Let's begin, exhale, lift and touch, inhaling back one. Exhale as we lift, pressing the left arm down 
and back two. Exhale, try and scrunch the abs and use them to lift up. And three. Exhale, use those abdom abdominal muscles. And back four. Exhale as we lift. And then back five. Exhale, lift and touch. And inhale, six. Exhale. Inhale, seven. And then exhale, last one. Eight. Excellent. So getting the legs together again. And taking the arms up overhead once more. So the next exercise is in boat position. We begin now. On the exhale, you're going to raise both the legs up, either one by one or together, 90 degrees. On the next exhale, raise the arms up, circle them up on the outsides of the legs. And with the next exhale, lift the torso up. So you can always keep the dumbbells and the hands behind the thighs to help hold you in position. Or then keep the arms on the outsides of the legs. And then we crisscross the feet eight times. Criss, cross, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Slowly roll back. Lower the arms down with the elbows bent and then the legs with control, and that's one. So we're gonna do eight of these, exhale, lift the legs up. On the next tail, ar exhale, arms in position, and then exhale, lift the torso. Try and keep the chest nice and lifted, arms parallel to the floor, or then under the legs, and we criss, cross. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, slowly rolling back, then getting the arms down with control, and then slowly the legs, and that's two. Exhale, the legs up. Exhale the arms and on the next exhale sit up keeping the legs stretched toes much much higher than the head and we criss cross three four five six seven eight slowly rolling back Yeah, the arms down with the elbows bent and slowly the legs with control either together or one by one and that's four and we exhale the legs up 90 degrees and we exhale the arms up with the next exhale we sit up nice and tall chest lifted and then we criss cross Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Slowly rolling back. Get the arms down to the floor. And slowly the legs with control. And that's five. Relax as you inhale. And then on the exhale, press the lower back down as you lift the legs up. And slowly the arms. And then smoothly the body. Balancing on our sits bones. And then we criss cross. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Slowly rolling down. Lower the arms to the floor. And then the legs with control. And that's six relax the body as you inhale press the lower back down exhaling lift the legs up and smoothly the arms and then sitting up nice and tall and we criss cross three four five six seven eight rolling back lower the arms to the floor and the legs and that's seven and one last on the exhale we lift the legs inhale relaxing exhale arms in position and with the next exhale we sit up and we criss cross three four five six seven eight rolling back slowly and getting the arms down and then slowly the legs pulling the feet up in butterfly position and letting the knees drop down to the side and relaxing the body here and bouncing the knees left and right relax and breathe and then get the knees together roll to the right side and roll over onto your abdomen and for the last two exercises, we need just the one dumbbell. So let's get one out of the way. Lie down with your chin on the mat. Stretch the arms out and hold the dumbbell on each side. So this exercise is deceptively simple. Looks very simple, but the stretch goes all the way down to your gut. You can feel it in your abdominal muscles. So all we need to do is raise and lower the dumbbell ten times. Let's begin. Exhale. One. Exhale. Two. Exhale. Three. Exhale. 4, exhale, 5, exhale, 6, exhale, 7, exhale, 8, exhale, 9, exhale, 10. And now for the final exercise, we're going to take this dumbbell behind our back, holding it with both hands and we do this slower and we're going to raise the dumbbell towards our head and lower it. So let's begin. On the exhale, we raise, inhale, lower it back to the hips, 1. Exhaling, raise up smoothly. Inhale, lower down with control, two. Exhaling, wonderful stretch for the shoulder girdle. Inhaling, three. Exhale, so ten of these. And then that's four. Exhale, we lift. Inhale, lower, five. Exhale, smoothly up. Exhale, six. Exhaling, raise. Inhale, seven. Exhale, as we lift. Inhale, 
eight, exhale, nine, exhale, ten. So we can get the dumbbell off and the hands under the shoulders, press down with the hands, come up on the knees and we sit back again in Vajrasana. So that's the end of our segment three and our yoga with weights workout. And I suggest do this workout very regularly. Initially try and do it more frequently, every day, every other day. And then put it into some kind of rhythm, maybe every week or every other week. And I'm sure you're going to see lots of good results. And every part of the body is going to benefit. So good luck with that. Thanks.